with me today. Today I'm going to show you how to play, um, or, or I should say how to plug in your Sega Genesis into a DVD player. Okay, step one, get your Sega Genesis. And this is the classic edition, so I forgot to say that, too. All the ones on the back. Step two, get your two Sega Genesis controllers. This is Z. Step three, get your plug-in. So I got my, the, first, uh, so I have the first plug-in cord. And, just, and finally, step four, get your HDMI. Okay, so first you'll want to see it. If your car has a plug-in port, like right here, like this is what I'm talking about, right here. A lot of cars have this, so it's going to be pretty obvious to find this. So plug them. Okay, plug them. You see that all the way took up the screen? Step two, plug it. Plug, plug away into the console. Hold on. Let me try to... Hold on, guys. There we go. Now, it may be powered on, but there's nothing on the screen. Okay, so... And... And then after that, plug in your HDMI. Yeah. First the white one. Second the yellow one. And finally third the red one. And as now, this is only found in rare cars. A HDMI plug and port. What are you doing? Dad, what are you doing? Trying to find something. Okay. So, do as normal now. This is probably going to be normal. So, only work cars have this. So, but I'm just going to do the unplugging. I mean, the plugging in off camera. And after you would do that, you have to go and pl uh, as normal plug in your controller so you can control the system. Now this will work with a classic Genesis, so don't worry. You have a classic one, but not a classic edition one, like the big heavy one. Now, go to your car settings and turn on the AVA port. But since we already have done the... Dad! What? You're going to the settings to turn on the... Off the AV, AVA port. What are you doing? I thought you wanted me to... No! I was... I didn't want you to do that. It's always turned... What I was gonna say is, but since it's already turned on, so dad, don't do anything. Well, I was gonna turn the sound on so they could hear it. Oh wait, yeah, okay, never mind. So you took go to source? Yeah, go to source. Then you go rear? Rear. Okay, so then, you have to go to the car settings, turn on the AVA port. The remote. Oh. Rusty car. Okay. But since it's already turned on, let us turn on the system. I said turn on the system. Why isn't it turning on like how it's supposed to? What? Stop messing up, Wolfie!
Ah, turn off the SD reader mode. And see, now it works, right? Okay, nothing's on. Now see, now it works. Turn it off. See, now it works. Well, let's, let us load up a game. How about them Sonic 1? I think it's gonna be too big. Okay. Now it works. See some gameplay. Turn it down a little bit. No, turn it up a little bit more. Up, 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 that's it. And now it works. But since there's a headphone zap, and then my mom has a wear sure. You can plug in your headphones and yeah. And now you can play your games on a little screen. Isn't that awesome? It sure is. So yeah. That's it. That's a wrap. No, go back, go back. Let this, let that mode be on still. No, listen, I'm trying to find a Walmart so we don't have to go all the way past okay. the Okay, 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 guys. So, yeah, guys, bye.